Moscow is confronting NATO with demands it knows the alliance cannot meet, NATO Secretary General Jens Stoltenberg said at the Munich conference, adding that there are no signs of a Russian withdrawal from the borders of Ukraine and that the risk of a conflict was real. The leaders of the eastern Ukraine breakaway regions of Donetsk and Luhansk have declared a full military mobilization, moves that come amid a spike in violence in the war-torn region that the West fears could be used as a pretext for an invasion by Russia. Russia's President Vladimir Putin said he will oversee major military drills along Ukraine's borders on Saturday, while Ukraine's President Volodymyr Zelensky is headed to Europe to drum up support. The United States, together with its allies, will impose significant and unprecedented economic costs on Russia if it further invades Ukraine, Vice President Kamala Harris said, adding that national borders should not be changed by force. We have prepared economic measures that will be swift, severe, and united, Harris said. We will target Russia's financial institutions and key industries. The US would also further reinforce the eastern flank of NATO in the event of a Russian invasion of Ukraine, Harris said at the Munich Security Conference, which she attended in person.